just woke up from a dream today is um, January 4th and I dreamt that I was of course in America and all these people all their stuff packed and um, I told everybody they needed to move towards the north where it was safe um, but a lot of people wanted to go south and I said you can't you've got to go north well, as they were going south I seen that America was under fire I'm talking about the whole United States all the way around it I seen it plain as day, a big old map and fire all the way around it and I said how are we supposed to get out and they said it's supposed to entrap the people so I said okay I'm gonna we gotta figure it out so they were all lined up in a line and it was like they were marching there was there was no kids in my dream and I seen I was a leader and people were trusting me and I told them we have to go to Moscow we have or yeah not Moscow Turkey and Quebec and then um, I woke up I just thought it was crazy um, okay so now I'm going to give you the interpretation thank you Jesus for three people's confirmations and prayer all right so um, one it was in winter my dream two um, people's stuff were packed and there was no kids meaning that there um, was already a rapture type okay into safety today's the fourth and 1421 in the strongs means hard of interpretation reveling words or reproach and it means shortened now prior to that we have um i have a friend named Brittany. she um her and i had a dream the same day which was today uh she dreamt of black horse and it was on fire and i said oh my gosh in revelation 6 5 through 6 that's talking about the collapse of the economy well, she's like, uh, you know, yeah, but there's a pair of scales. Remember that? And just like Darla, thank you, that the scales balance. One goes up, the other goes down. That's how a scale works. See what I mean? Okay. And Quebec means a narrow passage. And this is in uh, correlation to Canada. Okay. Um, which means it's not a part of America. It is the only remaining walled city. Okay. In North America, north of Mexico, and was recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1985, which was 35 years ago. And among its other distinguishing characteristics are its narrow cobblestone streets, stone buildings, fortifications, and French-Canadian culture grounded in the French language. And it is also one of 13 provinces and territories of Canada, and it is bordered west by the south province of New Brunswick and the U.S. states of Maine, New Hampshire, Vermont, and New York. And a lot of people have had uh, things about that. And we know uh, Macron's not to be trusted, okay? And Turkey's original, you know, Turkey. I was like, I don't understand this. But most of uh, in Quebec and Turkey have correlation because they are called Turkish Canadians, okay? So, so they originated from there. Okay, and that's why, because it's outside of America only, this is talking about, okay, like the marching um, and everything we know symbolizes in March. The, the new year, you know, people's like, oh man, if t we're still here, you know, and it's 2021, that means that everyone was wrong about 2020, about the redemption. No, we are still technically in 2020 because the new year, the Jewish new year does not end until March. Okay, and in March... Um, is, is when the harvests began and we've got the Passover, the barley, and uh, all that. And then I got confirmation. Carly sent me a video about Minister Paul. And Minister Paul just did a video this morning about a flag being on fire. And it is a it is a talk to America. Okay? The Holy Spirit's coming all over me and it's speaking to me. The great army. That is what this is, which is coming from the north. I'm going to read to you Isaiah 43. Who I got the Holy Spirit all over me, guys. Woo-wee! 
Uh, Ezekiel 20, 47 says this as well. Where is it? Hold on. Come on, God. Help me get this message out. Um, Ezekiel 20, 47. Right here it says this. Behold, I will kindle a fire in you, and it shall devour every green tree, every dry tree in you. The blazing flame shall not be quenched, and all faces from the south to the north shall be scorched by it. All flesh shall see that I, the Lord, have kindled it, and it shall not be quenched. Do you not understand that this is talking about how America is doomed? These vaccinations, all this, and on top of that, we have... Um, the Jews who have now 90% of them have been vaccinated and they're already starting next week, the second round of vaccinations. And this is what's bringing back most of the Jews. Um, and then my friend, Mark, uh, he just had a dream, um, you know, about parking garages and things and people in, uh, blue shirts and had uh, menorahs who were gold and they had the three, they were only three menorahs. And we know that Satan mimics, you know, the father, the son, and the Holy spirit, only that would be Satan, the beast and what we have the false prophet. So they're all working together. Okay. It's, it's a deception. The vaccinations is a deception. And we though are going to be spared. So all of this tying in together, um, my next video, I'm going to have this Bible study presented and ready. I'm telling you, we are in some crucial, crucial times ahead of us.